I feel I, good about our defense, um, yeah, especially we, against their offensive line. I don't expect a whole lot. Yeah, of whole we game. haven't we haven't allowed a whole lot of rushing yards. Um, I don't expect that to change very much. That's been the that's been the best you know most consistent aspect of the team all season is the run defense. It's yep. nobody nobody's been able to run on Clemson this year. Nope. Um, uh, the bet I think the best rushing performance that anybody's had was uh was Wake Forest and they, I think they ran for 110 but on like 40 carries so right you know, like, like two yards two terrible average yeah yeah. Um, yeah Hunter XT got two sacks yeah we talked about that Absolutely. yeah it's, yeah it's it's so great to see XT Good back to it, see looks, him, it, man. it looks like he it looks like he never left um clear clear the um I and it makes me happy they didn't rush him back because you know. Yeah. We we want to see. I mean, obviously the def, you know the defensive line has played really well without him, and now it's just as long as those guys stay healthy. I, I don't know of any front right now that you know offensive line that's that's especially uh, within the the conference that's going to be able to you know hold up. Yep. JT, I'm a Clemson homer. I love my Tigers, but they need to be more consistent. Is all I'm saying. Yeah, absolutely. I we'll, we'll get there. Yeah, I think and we. I think we I think this we're team is building in the right up direction. Yeah. yeah, I think yeah. we're 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 a team right now um, that gets a little bit better. You know, every week you can see growth in this team. Not that we play our best game. You know, every week. Obviously, this was not our best game, especially on offense. But I think you could you can see a progression throughout Clemson season, and you're not seeing that with every team. So right. uh, I think it's okay. Uh, we can all be honest and say. This is not a national championship team right now. Um, but we know that they have to be judging, ability. but judging yeah. by how much better they are versus Georgia Tech, you know, till now in the season when we're six and zero, there's a big difference, right? So carry that out through a whole season. If we continue to get better, uh, we might just be a national championship team by the end of the season when the time comes to actually play the game. So. Uh, and oh, and it was it was good that th- there weren't really any injuries of note tonight that I can I can think of. Yeah, yeah, that was that was one of the big keys we wanted to get out of the game, right? No yeah. major injury, especially on the defensive side of the ball. Looks to be that happened. Uh, we even got uh, a nice early Christmas present. We uh, present we got to see uh, XT uh, for the first time this season, and he yeah. did not he did not disappoint. Yeah. Um, DK says Clemson has the best resume. Um, they still, yep. They, well, I mean, they, they're still the only team, as, as far as I know, with yeah two top fifteen wins. So, um, yeah, I, I mean, it, it's hard to argue. I I don't know why we we didn't jump uh, Michigan last week, but you know, it is what it is. I don't really I don't really get hung up on the rankings too much if it's not the college football playoff rankings. Uh, John Saring gets in. Not to be a downer, but watching on the field, it looks like EJ is just checked out. Uh, is anybody? Um, if, if anybody transfers trans- in December, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't know. I I want to hold. I want to hold out hope, but yeah, it he hasn't really shown up. Uh, yeah, it wouldn't I, surprise had, me if he transferred, but I yeah, hope it wouldn't. Not. Yeah, it wouldn't shock me, but. I still, you know, I want to believe that he's, um, I, that there's room, you know, there's a place for him with with yeah. this, with this offense. Um, and you got to think, it's like I, he hardly played last year, mm-hmm. um, and you know he could just be behind. I mean, he's a he's a junior as far as um, how long he's been here, but it just he, he hasn't played a ton. I mean, he he flashed a lot towards the end of his freshman year, but yeah. But and that's now, the last time he really, really played, right? Yeah, um, but you know, last year he hardly got—he was hardly able to get on the field. Uh, he was just in and out of the lineup with, with injuries. So, yeah, um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe he is checked out. We don't. I don't want to. I don't want to speculate on on that. Yeah, I don't either. Uh, Jared gets in, makes entry, makes an interesting observation. Said he looked like he was scared of contact out there. It may be, uh, you know, when them injuries really start piling up, and you know. Uh, things like that happen, and every time you go out there, somehow you nick a a new thing or get a new injury. You know that can that can probably shake your confidence. Yeah, maybe, maybe um, he doesn't. And, maybe yeah. he doesn't trust it. You know, yeah. maybe he doesn't trust himself or and or trust. He, his... he may be he may be completely fine uh, physically and you know mentally just 
you know, fighting that fear of, uh, you know, getting hurt again. You know, that's, that's a possibility. I don't think that's uh, I don't think that would be crazy. I couldn't blame him, honestly. 